Q&A. Oh, we need a camera for this. Maybe next time, when you have more YouTube money to buy cameras. I don't know how you people manage it, but you came up with about 30 more sick fucking disgusting questions. 34... It's gonna be long. Uh, I, don't, I didn't really count anything, so uh, let's, let's just go. The <laughs> first one's yours. They're all mine. <laughs> They're all mine! Do you bruise easily? Like a peach. No, I've never broken a limb and I don't bruise easily. I, in matter of fact, tried to crack my knuckles open in rage when I was playing Super Monday Night Combat last Why week. Why would you want to know this question? Why? It's all subjective to idiocy. Next question. I remember when you said Bulgarians ha Bulgaria has hot girls. I saw a Bulgarian girl on the news. She was not hot. What gives? She lied about her nationality. Next question. Who is Tony named after? Um, Tony Montana? You totally made that up. I don't know who I was uh, named after, but... Oh yeah, that uh, famous 19th century ballerina. Before this gets any creepier... Uh, nope. Oh, it's the riddle part. <laughs> oh, great. Son of a bitch. If he dropped his pants and stuck his poo as Tony puts it, there would be, st there would still be poo marks on his legs. Wait, let me read that again. <laughs> if he dropped his pants and stuck his poo, as Tony put it, there would be still poo mark on his legs. Okay, since that wasn't a sentence, you said that when a guy was running and he grabbed his pants, if he tried to pull his pants down and run away, he'd still be poo on his pants. No, on his legs. So how does he... This is stupid. What kind of a Q&A is this? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, next question. Do you like something for the DJ by Pitbull? That's always plays in a whatever bar and it makes my head hurt. Um, I despise Pitbull with a burning passion and he is the bane of music. Yeah, pretty Who, much. Who's Pitbull? A dude who's bald, who can't even speak his own language. Uh, he's really bald. And he just yells out Spanish words. He, he's a very bad musician. So, yeah. Next. Yeah, next question. Do you agree with me that Raiden from Metal Gear is the worst game character of all time? If not, who is? It's Raiden. Let's see. So I don't know what. It's Raiden. Uh, no, it's Raiden. Did S Snake say Raiden? Never mind. Uh, I haven't yet played Metal Gear Solid 2. I'm gonna buy it on the Vita when it comes out. Uh, but no, uh, the the usual answer to this question would be Navi from Ocarina of Time. Or, she wasn't from Ocarina of Time. I don't know what. I think she is from Ocarina of Time. Or uh, I don't know any character from the Call of Duty franchise. But I'm gonna go with Beggar Lady from Assassin's Creed. Because uh, they serve no purpose other than to be exploited. I don't. I don't think. I think they main main characters or something. No, it's a character from a video game. I hate the beggar lady, cause 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 when you punch dudes who try to harass you, the guards are like, hey, that specially dressed man is just punching dudes. When you punch a lady, get him, <laughs> dishonor. Actually, isn't that only in the last game? I mean, I remember that specific. Every. Well, I remember this in specifically in Revelations, like, you punch a Turkish dude and he's like, Oh, I'm sorry, offend him. You punch a woman. Get him! Destroy him! <laughs> annihilate! Okay. <laughs> Women's, you know. It's Beggar Lady. If you can think of something else, because I tried, but I couldn't. Surely I can think of, but right now, hmm. There are a lot of people. Mostly the damsels in, damsels in distress. You heard it here first. Sonia's sexist. Next question. <laughs> sure. Nope. Who is sicker? Tony or your friend? I don't know. What? Explain the term multi-level governance used in the passage. The term multi-level governance 
No, we are not answering your school quizzes. Do this by yourself and you will become a splendid person. Smart people, they're using us to answer their homework. Yeah, two weeks late. Um, <laughs> did you ever watch the TV show Muslim Driving School? That show was really bad. Um, hmm. I, I'm trying to think of an adequate joke, but no. And uh, please don't bomb my house. <laughs> okay, no, that, that was horrible. That was horrifying. <laughs> you suck. There's a show called Muslim Driving School. What do... I, I think I'm allowed to make those jokes, because what is a show called Muslim Driving School going to be about? Drive-bys? That was even worse. <laughs> um, next. Do you or Tony have part-time jobs? If so, I bet there are really some really sick shop like... What's that? It's like Boundwitch. Poundwich. Oh, it's like sandwich, but it's Poundwich. British people. Well, isn't Svetus part-time job being on YouTube? Hardly call this a job. <laughs> and doesn't <laughs> earn enough money to be called a job. You have enough money to buy characters from uh, Super Monday Night Combat. I bought him a <laughs> character. Why? <laughs> Shit. Oh, God, next. <laughs> but no, we don't have part-time jobs. Not at all. We're poor as shit. You're poor as... No, you, you're not... Never mind. Your family's rich. You're poor. You own a house! <laughs> Fuck you in the face. I don't own a house. That's my family. You live at the top of the... Never mind. The top of the capital. <laughs> the, the, he just... You're like a village overlord and you just stupid rat guests all overlooking the peasants next to the river. Okay, next question. I have an idea for an invention. How many questions do you submit? <laughs> I have a, an idea for an invention. Basically, it's a toilet in a shower so you can poo and wash at the same time. You like. Well, we are not the committee that rates that... poo and washing at the same time. <laughs> so... Cleanpoo.com <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like another porn site. I'm going are, after right? that no, URL. <laughs> Uh, that would be horribly inefficient, because it would be a never-ending cycle of cleanliness and dirtiness. But, uh, we, especially Mr. Fuse, likes, um, to have a site called, um, how, how was it called again? Lesbian Showers, yes, that's the one. How <laughs> is the site lesbianshowers.com not taken yet? What kind of an idiot well, is... Well, they have angry boobs. Angryboobs.com, <laughs> come on. Like someone won't make a porno parody of angry birds. Mark my words, th this will this will turn into a franchise. Next question, Sony Ericsson, it good. That's not a question. <laughs> uh, do you agree all communist names end with Y? Wait, wait, no. Is Tony more of a communist than Joe? Who's Joe by Joby? That's the thing. I'm trying to skip over questions that are specific towards the guy who submitted them because they're literally unanswerable. Also, do you agree all communist names end in Y? Lenin, Stalin, <laughs> Trotsky. Oh, wait, the <laughs> one, less one ends. And I. I think you made oh, your yeah. point. <laughs> Why do you play such obscure games? Why not just play normal games like Truth or Lie or Stormrise? What's Truth or Lie? Hell, what's Stormrise? Ah, uh, we play obscure games, rather I do, because it's something at least partially original on YouTube. Because <laughs> uh, I think they yield more laughs than games that are um, more of a mainstream thing. Like, I I'm not going to play Call of Duty because it's oversaturated and stupid and I have nothing to add to that thing. But I can play, like, hell, 50 Cent Blood on the Sand, Enslaved, um, some other games that I'm not going to reveal just yet because I'm planning on playing through them. But I just play more obscure games because they're funnier. Because they generally don't lack the, um... And he just gives me hard games so I can play Yeah, them. that too, because I hate him. But I generally do play them because their their budget is smaller, I guess you can say. And that makes for more holes in the game that can be exploited for funny. So, there. One of the reasons. What do, what do the Bulgarians think of the British? I don't mind them. They have a nice accent. And Though, they... uh, I like Jason Statham. Oh, everybody <laughs> likes Jason just... Statham, because he plays the same guy in every movie. Yeah, so the British... They should just make Jason Statham's Jason Statham and be done with it. Yes, the British? 
Oh, By your expression, I'm judging there's no thoughts in your head currently. They come so. from France. <clears throat> Why is Nicolas Cage on the cover of a Serbian biology textbook? What? Let's click on the site. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, why do you think we should know that? <laughs> <laughs> That's for Nicolas Cage to know and for us to ponder. Whoa, this is just one of the mysteries of the universe. But nice hair. Except that Nicolas Cage has an eagle on his head and is in the tune. Link is below, you can see it also no, for Link, yourself. No, it's on the screen right now because of the magic of editing. Anyway, is there a Bulgarian equivalent to Manston Park? Don't know what that is. I think it's a park. Um, probably. So yes, Google we do it. have those. Google I'm it. not gonna Google it. Chill, dude. God Come. damn it. I'm gonna... We still have no idea what that is. After a quick Google search. Next. What do you think? What do you currently study at school? What do you want to study at university? And where will you study? Oh, wow, that's an actual question. You go first. Uh, I currently study economics, and I'm gonna. Boring. You go, Mr. Fancy Ass Photoshop <laughs> douchebag. Well, I don't study that right now at school. I study that at home, but. At I... school, he currently studies what? Nothing. Nothing! I just go there, there are no lessons, I go home. But I'm supposed to study in the first English language school, like studying English so I can make this... It's a front for heroin dealers. <laughs> yes. My uh, building is purple. No, 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 we <laughs> went from heroin to pot because... Oh, thank God. Yes, yeah, because Snoop Dogg changed everything. <laughs> Blessed be the dog. Uh. <laughs> so I... I will continue to study in Bulgaria but I'll study like um, what's it called graphic design like Photoshop um, 3D Studio Max I'll make uh, games and I'll send them to Svetlin so he can make I uh, look like, forward to throwing small change at you from my monstrous tower which I will eventually build once I conquer this puny country well, it's gonna be in Svetlin it's gonna Enterprise. be asymmetric and sharp so you so poor people like you can't hang off the side Svetlin Enterprise no it's gonna be something really really cool like dark edge corporation <laughs> <An> Empire <laughs> Empire <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Ulfric Stormcloak is the worst video game character of all time. <laughs> yes, there we go. This is for you. My grandma told me that... Wait, you didn't answer where, oh, you, right. where you study. Ah, uh, Colland. Am not Amsterdam. Um, Utrecht? Some, just Colland, general. I'm Wait, gonna roam the been land and... Haven't you been accepted yet? Three universities, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna roam the land and collect knowledge and pots. Listening to Metallica. <laughs> <laughs> the same song over and over. Spread the knowledge of n not knowing stuff. Uh, <laughs> My grandma told me that beer is really cheap in Bulgaria. Would this be true, Mr. Fuse Tony? Dos Santos? I think that's a clever pun on a beer. But um, it is, is beer cheap? Well, I don't know how expensive it is in other countries. But uh, yeah, it's pretty cheap. Like 75 euro cents would be... Something like that, yeah, for a uh, five hundred. drink, son, give a <laughs> fuck. Well, 75 euro cents for 500 milliliters. Sometimes even 50 euro cents. That's a lot of hundreds of cents. I can't Fif care about beer. I don't fuck beer. Um, I don't fuck beer. Well, I don't fuck beer either, but I drink it sometimes. Oh, God, you're horrible. Uh, okay, next one is for me, apparently. Uh, how do you say that name? Emil or Emily? Let's see. Emil? I don't know, just someone. Okay, so a dude or a girl named Emil or Emily once told me those bitches aren't got shit on chocolate magic. Those bitches ain't got shit on chocolate magic. Hmm. Should we answer this with potato? I would go with potato, yes. <laughs> okay, potato it is. Wait, I have a better one. I hate my mother for cleaning the house and finding this thing. <coughs> Next one. Bullshit button. Take it. Do you chew like a mofo? Google. Once again. No. Oh. That literally means do you chew hard? Next question. Are you happy shoe nice 22 liked and favored the last Q&A? Am I ever? Who's oh boy. Yay. 
Next question. Oh, it's somebody else from the regular four people. Tell us more tweets. If someone was to say to you, I'm going to stick you up like a poster. And this has TWO meanings. Two. Oh, yeah, two meanings. How would you... <laughs> I thought it was... It's, it's weird how you... <laughs> two meanings. How would you respond? Teeth. Don't stab me, and then stab won't fuck me. Hey, that's my response. I don't know what the fuck you're thinking, but I'm going practical here. What's T W O? Okay, you're going to stick me. Next question. Threaten you with violence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give me my mouse. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. There Can we go. you organize a meetup for your fans? Preferably of the Abby Grange Six Form Center or the John Rex. I'm not fussy. As far as organizing a meetup goes, um, impossible. He's waiting for a Comic Con, so somebody. Can I'm invite. waiting for the Comic Cons <laughs> where I can meet the Captain Americas and the Batmans. Yeah. And my hang out with the the the. We'll, we'll meet you there in. Three never. Three years or never. <laughs> That's for you. Next one. You can just find a bunch of people so they can uh, sympathize with Svetlin. And uh, if we have enough audience, we'll go whatever you want. That wasn't a question. Next. <laughs> except message. Except me Wait, no. Anyway, next one. Tony, remember that Malcolm in the Middle episode where they invented a new color? Give us a, a review of it. It was funny. I, I load a I, lot. I don't describe Kelp. I. No context. What? Was there really a Malcolm in the Middle episode when they invented a new color? No. That, you know, Reese? Yeah. He just took the blue and yellow and mixed them. What do you get? Blue yellow? Yeah, but it's. Oh, <laughs> real? Like, Fuck! It's oh, actually. That's horrible! Yeah, it's actually green. Oh, that's the worst joke ever. Oh, I was being ironic. <laughs> That's 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 truly horrible. That is actually well, I, when I watch it, it would, you need to listen how he said it. It's very funny. Yeah, sure, right, sure. It's actually green that he gets, but whatever. Mm -hmm. Has Tony ever been as high as Magoo? Who's that? Mag Magoo? I don't know what that means. But Wait, Magoo? You mean that blind dude? There's a blind dude named Magoo. No, it's Mr. Magoo. Haven't you watched the movie? What it's movie? That, Mr. Magoo, he's that one guy that barely sees. Wasn't that that movie where Robin Williams had like a little green thing that jumped? That was Flubber. Um, they had that mob mobile, how is it called again? Uh, a trailer? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. They had a mobile home called the trailer. Trailer the tra No, I have never been as high as him. <laughs> Next question. <laughs> Who has kidnapped more people, Tony or Coney? Definitely you, if we count video games, yes. Mostly me, and my sanity, and my ability to play video games, which you sap like a freaking vampire through a straw of pain, sadness, and Today's opposite day. Today's opposite day. I'm not gonna punch you in the face. What the hell does Tony look like? Well, in the title screen, you'll see. <laughs> what? Oh god, he has an idea. Uh, who is the other sicko in this video? I went ahead and uh, watched the video in question. That's the lawnmower, who is also the third guy who appears in the uh, Dragon Force video. No. Uh, the, oh, the Dragon Force. Yeah, I'm confused with Lair. The dude who is not Tony. <laughs> oh, wait. Yeah, there's me and the... And that answers what Tony looks like. <laughs> He's the dude. How should we fucking describe you? Um... Did you make the horrible joke with the G-string? Yeah. Did, so the guy who made the horrible joke with the G-string and the, the passive man who just winked at him is the lawnmower who just laughs like a lawnmower. He has no purpose in this life. Except laughing. And, and asking for money, apparently. <laughs> um, Sometimes I do a poo in the... Oh, my God. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> your, your name is an anagram for third mongrel. Discuss. I can't even spell anagram. Why do you never fully answer a question? Next question. 
Uh, <laughs> is this Tony? Maybe. In my spare time. Is English your second language because you speak amazingly good English? Uh, thank you. <laughs> Yes, okay, yes, it is. Could we speak? No, we're not gonna speak Bulgarian because it sounds stupid. Um, I wonder how people like li when you when they listen to us. How does it sound like? It's normal for us for us to listen to Bulgarian, but I don't know for them. It probably sounds like insane ramblings. Should we say something? No, we're not. Uh, who speaks better English, Tony or Tommy Wiseau? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Ow, that actually broke my jaw. It's not true, I speak good English. It's not true! It's not. He tried, people. He he tried. Are you well? No, that's not... What? Uh, <laughs> have you ever bought a already sharpened pencil? If so, how did it make you feel? Accomplished. Yes, these questions that you, you find... No, no, it's it's awesome when you buy a sharpened pencil because then you don't have to go home and be like, man, I sure wish I knew where everything was at my house so I can sharpen this goddamn pencil. But then you're like, oh, man, everything in my house is a mess. It's I like can't this... find it and my pencil sharpener is broken. My wife left three It's years like ago. that leather uh, whip that I saw <laughs> yesterday for sale in a Bulgarian uh, shop. It, it's, yeah. it was in a carnival shop, just let me I'm say. This is myself from that. <laughs> and the description was a leather whip. You can use it for whatever you like. What did you click on it with E? Oh, fuck. never mind. What does I... what does it feel like if you use, use a... a kiwi? Um, annoying. It's quite satisfying. Actually, satisfactory. I can't even peel those damn things. I'm too lazy. Next Duh. question. On mine and kills. Oh god. Again, a specific one. But again, on mine and kills. That's his friend. Mental tour. Mental world tour of Eastern Europe. Shall we stop in Bulgaria? Is it sick enough? What's a mental world tour? It's when you doze off and pretend you go someplace, preferably with the help of PCP and or weed. Pass. Acid. What did I say? Whatever. Uh, uh, you take that one. I can't even think of anything. Well, there are some sick people sometimes. They go to the hospital and they get cured. I'm going to take this one because he is not funny. I'm going to say yes, but only if you decide to go anywhere within the limits of civilization, which is basically if you enter the country from any direction that is not a direct para drop into the capital. So thank you for watching. This was the second q and I don't know when we're going to do a third one, but please next time post more focus questions and not really specific. I'm looking at we you. We really don't care about your friends. <laughs> he doesn't. I do. No. Subscribe. No, you can't use that against me. I can. I you can use everything against your face. And we're done. See you next time.